Can you say good morning? Hey. Oh, you want to poop? Okay. Today, you guys, is Hershey Mama's last day here. Mwah, mwah. Hey. Yeah, that sucks, huh? But I think we're going to go to the city. And today, I don't know why, but I was up at like 6 o'clock. I was just up. Bam was up too, but he was just hanging out in his crib. So I was like, you know what? Let me get up and get like ready for the day. Because I always feel so much better when I'm like, when I get something done before I get him. Like anything. <laughs> it can be the smallest thing. So I got up took a shower, I got out, and he was still just playing in his crib. So I was like, hmm, maybe I'll do my hair. Did my hair, still just playing. So did my makeup. He was still just playing. So I just went and got him after I was all ready. And he has been just so good today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what a lion says, bam bam. But not every animal says right. <laughs> what about the monkey? What does the monkey say? What's the monkey say? Say, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what's the lion say? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's the lion say, bam bam? Yeah. <laughs> what's the ducky say? Go. Yeah, quack, quack. You got it. Quack, quack, uh-huh. So, the funniest thing happened at the grocery store. I went to, I went in to get some cabbage because my boobs are going to explode. And um, if you guys don't know, cabbage is supposed to help you dry out. And I went in there and this old lady, she was with her grandkids. And I was just like, yeah, I just need some. <laughs> I don't even know how this came up, but I was just like, I just need some cabbage for some pain relief. She was like, oh. I know how that is. She goes, here, just take the two leaves. You don't need the whole thing. And I was like, oh, thanks. <laughs> that was so nice. I had my wife steal two of cabbage. No, she put the cabbage in her cart. She was buying it. She was already looking at the cabbage. We were both looking at cabbage when we were there. I think we were on an episode of What Would You Do? <laughs> and I failed. <laughs> Just walk out I'm two just, of cabbage. She Nobody was buying the cabbage. No, no. I went to the restroom. I didn't do it right there. Oh, that's good. Gosh. <laughs> we were like, we were just stuff in our <laughs> But it was just so funny. She was like, "Oh, I know how that is." It was just, you know, it was. It was great. I didn't have to buy cabbage. So that's nice. Let's say figure out that cabbage. <laughs> Oh, let me just put cabbage on my breast. Just see what happens, you know. A lot of women do it. It's it's a thing. Yeah, but so I are you gonna smell cabbage. like cabbage? Like if it's super hot outside today, or are you gonna really smell like cabbage? I don't know. I've never done this before. Oh, like my wife smells like cabbage. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't know how this works. It's... Anyways, we're gonna continue. have arrived and we got free parking win-win this guy always wants to push the stroller <laughs> Silly goose. we're just walking around exploring you know that park over there maybe we'll go to that park but all Bam's gonna want to do is go in that water he loves being in the water. Yay.
go grab some food at Indie Kitch. What's it called? Indie Kitch, I think. You guys, this place is bomb. Bam Bam loves it too. Uh. And we continue our walk. All right, you guys, so we're walking through Central Park. Um, getting ready to head out and take this guy to the airport. Me and Hershey have a lot of similarities. Amongst those similarities, we both like to be early. So his plane doesn't leave till 7. <laughs> it's about 2.30 now. He's getting a little anxious. He's like, hey, guys, uh, I think we should start heading back to the airport. It's, uh, you know. I just don't want anything to go wrong. It's only five hours. I would rather, and personally, and, and I know he shares this, but I would rather sit in the airport and wait right next to my gate than be doing other stuff. Because then when you're not doing that, like what's on your mind is just the airport anyway. So it's just like I might as well be there because I'm thinking about it and I drive myself crazy. And you never know what's going to happen. So Just sit right in front of the gate. I usually do. Crisscross applesauce. Yep. So as soon as they start Boarding. loading people up, I'll just stand up yeah. right there. And then we're always both in group three, so we gotta yep. wait anyway. So then you gotta wait <laughs> But anyway, yeah, so we're walking through Central Park. Um, we went to this place, I know you guys just saw it in the last scene, but we went to this place called Indie Kitchen. Uh, it was super good, everybody liked it. Hershey compared it to Indian airplane food. When you go to India, that's like the airplane food they serve. But it's, it's like way better. Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, what do you rate that place? Let's start with Hamali. 10. <laughs> Kirsch? I say that's like a good 7. Yeah, I, I, I'd give it a 9 because uh, the food was actually really good. I got chicken tikka. Um, there, there's samosas. But, um, what'd you order? I had uh, the biryani with um, chana. Biryani and Hamali's this kind of person. When like in the future, if I tell her you ordered biryani with chenna, she'll be like, "No, I didn't. I ordered something else. I, I ordered some else shot." And then we'll play the video, and she'll be like, "I must not have remembered right when I said that." <laughs> Hershey, what did you order? I ordered chicken tikka. Yeah, and it was really good. So it was good. The only it, thing that I, that I wish it would have been cooler, like if I actually went there more, is if they would have had more like variety. Yeah. You see the chicken tikka or chenna. That's yeah. all I felt. And Bam had what we had. So as predicted, we are super early to the airport. It is 4 o'clock. This week is at 7 o'clock. So we're just hanging out. We are in the cell phone parking, whatever it's called. Just hanging out, letting this guy take a nap because he's really, really tired. And those two are playing back there. He's hanging out. And guess what, you guys? One of my really, really good friends got engaged yesterday. Birthday, so happy belated birthday and a happy engagement, you guys. Is that like a thing? Happy engagement? I'm not sure. But they've been together for 10 years, they've been together for like as long as I can remember. So that is super, super cool. Congrats, guys! What's he's gonna that? be running around and he's gonna be like talking, more sign language. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be so different, it's gonna be so much bigger. Mm -hmm. Two months. It's gonna be in November. Oh, we're gonna miss you, kid. All right, all right. Don't forget about me, huh? I'm the Hershey Mama. Hey, on camera. <laughs> two months. What? He said two months. Two months. No, you guys are coming in October. Oh. Good flight. Out of our lives. <laughs> He's having a hard time with that luggage. <laughs> Does he have <laughs> yeah, he just couldn't open it. Open the little thing that goes all the way up. I am in so 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 much pain. Holy cow! Yesterday, if you don't know, yesterday was the last day I breastfed Bam Bam. And today, I have been in pain all day, but ever since we dropped Hershey off at the airplane, it's been like even worse. It's been really bad, really bad, you guys. It hurts so bad. 
I even tried cabbage earlier and it felt good for a little bit, but we're back to normal. So yeah, I need to do something. This hurts way too bad. But I feel so quiet near her. She is gone. But I guess he's got to go to school and get back to his life. Ugh, lame. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, Billy is putting Bam down to sleep. And we're about to relax. I need to make some dinner, but I just really don't feel like it. My boobs hurt so bad. Oh my gosh, really bad. Whoa, wowzers. Oh, I can't even think about anything else. <laughs> Anyways, you guys know the drill. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace, guys.